In this video, we'll cover the basics of using the button widget in a mashup. Buttons let you execute services for functions, widgets, or data entities with a simple click. This simple mashup contains three value display widgets and a confirmation function. The action click event of the confirmation function executes two data services from a thing. The return data is displayed in three value display widgets. First, we'll add a button to execute these services and update the data. To add a button to a mashup, drag the button widget from the widgets panel to a container on the canvas. You can use the layout panel to position the button in the container. When you select the button, its properties appear in the properties panel. You can edit button properties like size, labels, and icons. The label should reflect what happens when you click the button. We're using this button to update data for value display widget, so let's label it update. The icon property specifies a media entity to show as an icon within the button. The icon is displayed next to the text label. You can show text, an icon, or a combination of both. For the tooltip message, you can also choose an icon and a label. Let me show you. You can choose the button style with a button type property. Select from five different style types, primary, secondary, tertiary, danger, or transparent. You can set the default style for each type in the style theme editor. Now that we've set the button properties, bind the button to the confirmation function. Select the button and click the arrow. A list of bindable events appears. To create a binding, drag the clicked event to the open confirmation service on the functions panel. The confirmation function is now bound to the data services that you can see on the data panel. Now let's test the button. Click Save and then View Mashup. The tooltip appears when you place your pointer on the button. When you click the button, the confirmation dialog box opens. Click Update to update the data for the value display widgets. Data values are now displayed for each widget.